Uh, when I go out, I come back to Poland. Poland is home. But have you ever had uh, like any problem uh, linked to your color? So this is your YouTube star. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing there? Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to try a new activity. It's called Kangoo Fit. Um, it's the first time I will be doing it, so I will try to share this with you. I hope that I will be able to vlog there or just to record few parts. I know that we have to wear like specific shoes. just received my order from the African shop I have ordered some plantains uh, achiki and shikwan uh, to get them ready because we are going on a barbecue I decided to try this I saw in one video that um, if you have green plantain and you want them to be ripe so you can add one apple and close the bag for like a few days I will let you know if it works and if the test is the same. Hi. Hello, how are you doing? <laughs> Fine, and you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm in the kitchen doing grill. Okay. If you need some meat, <laughs> call me. Give it all. Why not? Can you uh, present us what you are cooking? Uh, today we have uh, fish. But this is not any kind of fish, it's mackerel, but not any kind of mackerel. Okay. It's mackerel, oya oya. That's it got a little bit of oil. Okay. Then we have some chicken, mm -hmm. not any kind of chicken, but oh, yes. spice with grain. Okay. Looking tasty. I see that you have your Cameroonian jersey. Yes, you know, I come from the continent Cameroon. Ah, okay, continent. <laughs> we will see if this food will be tasty. You know, there are a lot of people waiting to eat. We were supposed to be eating at 3. These people show up at 5 p.m. And then there was not gas. Yeah, so we had to wait that the host could buy some gas. And now we are starting to get the food ready. Yes. And really, look African how people. Look. How long have you been living in Poland? It depends what it looks like long for, uh, for someone. For me, I think been more than 10 years or less than 10 years is still not been long. Do you feel Polish? Uh, feeling Polish is an understatement because uh, feeling Polish is being born Polish. But I live here and I feel comfortable. Okay. You feel home? <laughs> yes. Somehow when I go out, I come back to Poland. Poland is home. But have you ever had uh, like any problem uh, linked to your color? Uh, oh. Of course, even in the US, there are people having problems with color. You so are defending Poland too much. Yes, because I feel home. Poland is my oh, home, and I will always defend yes. Poland. So great! Thank you for this feedback. <laughs> can you can you tell us about work in Poland? How easy is it for you to find job? And uh, saying easy, there's no way in this world where it's easy to get a job. You just need to be searching and have a lot of good luck. Mm -hmm. In terms of looking for job in Poland, mm -hmm. yes, the market is open. There are a lot of corporations here in Poland looking for people uh, who speak English and other languages. Mm -hmm. And not only in languages, you have uh, companies which are looking for hand, hand work, mm -hmm. like people who can do physical work as well. Mm -hmm. So in terms of job, there is job. Okay. There is job for everyone, but you just need to be searching and you just need to have the good luck as, as well as I said earlier. Which advice you can give to someone who is out of Europe? Because actually people who are uh, sending me messages are in Africa, most of them, other in like in Dubai or India and they would like to come to Poland for work. So um, which advice you can like give to them? Advice for people out of Poland, I will say don't out stop. Out of Europe. Uh, out of Europe, actually. Mm -hmm. Uh, don't stop applying. There are a lot of companies with online application. Uh, you can apply from abroad, mm -hmm. and after you apply, uh, pray on your good luck, yeah. uh, so that they can pick you. And if they pick you, then they will do all the documentation for you for to get and get the visa. Yeah, so, talking about the documentation, in my opinion, I feel like they are giving less work permit than a few years ago when I came. It's like 
Maybe also it's because there are now too many uh, foreigners here in Poland, so it's just easy for them to find um, someone with a specific language here than out of the country. I think the same, for mm. sure. Uh, the, po the politics have changed. Mm. Before, uh, some years ago, mm. Poland was recruiting a lot from outside. Mm. But now there are a lot of foreigners which came some years ago, mm. and a lot of people finish their education at the moment. Mm. And now there's the employee market which is full of people currently. Hi guys, I forgot to take my scarf and it's, uh, it's cold. Hey! Where are you going with the dress on Thursday? <laughs> I've just received my food. I took um, I regret. I totally regret. Why? You had uh, that's why I wanted that. Oh my god. <laughs> we can share. <laughs> Restaurant, but unfortunately there are a lot of people waiting so we are sitting here outside and feeding Sean because his time uh, his lunch time passed already so he was very hungry and uh, we are waiting I will show you the line I've heard that food here is very tasty so we will see if the wait was justified so I have just received my starter. I took burrata. Uh, hi. Yes. What are you doing there? The restaurant was extremely good. I recommend that place. Even if you'll be waiting 30 or 40 minutes outside, it, the wait is worth. Hi everyone, today we are trying Nigerian food. I've ordered uh, two meals from our Big If you if you're in Wrocław and you want to try Nigerian food, you can contact her. I've ordered um a gusi and afan or afana af yeah, I don't even know what is this afan. I don't know really, but um, I will try that today. Mm. So this is your YouTube star <laughs> from Poland. I will be one. Yes. If you me. don't know her, this check her me. channel. <laughs> She's the star. She's the African star in Poland. <laughs> She's doing everything. What do you mean by African star? <laughs> She's doing everything. She's cooking. She's organizing events. She's uh, what you are doing? Applications traveling. of traveling, applications of for <laughs> vlogger, life <laughs> influencer, everything. Yeah. And today we will try her food. Yes, I, I order. Nice I hope it's nice because now I'm never. If it's not nice, I will say the truth. I cannot lie. I'm sorry. <laughs> of course, of course, of course. We are open and, to feedback. Of and course. your your mother will see that you didn't learn well. You know. No problem. <laughs> Hi guys, uh, Satis did my hair and I was thinking to make a video with her but finally we were just enjoying gossiping you know <laughs> yeah and now I'm going to take my food because I ordered Ghanaian okra soup um, I decided to try different African food in Poland so yeah just to try something new something different everyone has his own way of cooking so when I'm cooking okra I know how it will be but if someone else is cooking it can be different so yeah I'm interested to try this new taste okay this is bantu. she told me that this is uh, like like cassava flour and uh, corn flour 
first time I'm trying this. It's different. It's different than normal fufu. Let me heat the soup and see how it tastes. I see that there are some shrimp and many other stuff. <sighs> At this moment, I have to try the food. My husband and kids are sleeping already. I will hit this food, put a movie, watch it, enjoy, and just have the best time alone. Guess who is the model photo today? It's not Shania, but me. <laughs> uh, we were contacted by a photograph asking if we could join a project. And I said yes, because I thought it would be for Shania. But finally, she wanted me to be the model. So yeah, it was a great experience. And I can't wait to see the result. Mama, belle. Et aussi belle comme la dernière fois when I moved in Poland, I had to stop my laser hair removal because I didn't know a place where they could make laser for a dark skin. And then I went pregnant, I was breastfeeding and went pregnant again and breastfeeding. So I couldn't do laser because uh, when you are pregnant or breastfeeding, you cannot just do laser. So now I decided to go back to it because waxing is destroying my skin. I have ingrowth hair, I have dark spots. I'm happy I found a place where I can do laser because I'm a hairy woman. Thank you. Thank you for watching the video. Please remember to subscribe, activate your notification support and share. Thank you guys. Bye. This is the result after five days. So depending on how ripe I want them to be, I can remove now or leave again for a few days.